Hello everybody, good morning and greetings once again from the Florida RV Super Show 2020 35th anniversary edition here and a couple of days ago uh, I showed you the new camp Avia but you guys have requested that I show you the other new camps and that's what I'm going to do today. I'm riding, 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 riding in my RV, my RV wherever I Cause I'm free in my RV yeah. Very nice uh, teardrops if you have a small SUV or you, you, know, you don't have the tow capacity to tow one of those large trailers uh, These are very nice Our friends uh, Omar and Jenny They, they have a uh, different brand but they, they, they really uh, swear by, the, by, their, uh, by their teardrop and some of these even fit in a standard uh, uh, garage, house garage, which is, which is also why so many people uh, get them. This one would be a total unit cost $20,000. But here at the show, I mean 22 MSRP, but here at the show, $16,999, 17. Which, let me see if I, if I know how to open this. I think it is locked. Well, they, yeah, they have this one. They have this one locked, but uh, we can look at another one. And all of this, they have this outside kitchen here in the back. This one has a two burner and a small sink. And um, there, <clears throat> that's your fresh water tank, so you can tell uh, how full or empty it is. Microwave. And here we have a new camp. Your hair is super pretty. Cooler. Today. You always have pretty hair. It's always good. <laughs> Perfect. One, two. <laughs> I have pretty hair too, you know. <laughs> and uh, here we have the inside. You have an air conditioner bed. You know, it's it's um <clears throat> it's a basic facilities, but it's a step up from a tent, which is the the whole point of some of this. This one is even smaller, and I'm losing my voice here real quick here. But this one also has the outdoor kitchen, very very similar microwave. This is a, a new camp Yeti. I'm not smart enough to open it. There you go, cooler. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, this, this feels very solid, very well built. I like that they, they have the. This is how you open and close your shade, and uh, maybe I don't think it is supposed to to come undone like that. Oops, I think I broke it. Well, I just. I'll just quietly walk away. <laughs> this is the boondock light. <clears throat> and this one, yeah, I guess that's why. And this one is more of a standard size uh, trailer. It's a very small trailer, but this one you can actually uh, walk in and stand on it. And uh, it's tiny, but it has everything you need. You have your shower, which I'm sorry to say, I don't fit in. As you know, I'm 5'10", and this would work for a short person, but for me, it would not. But then again, you're talking about a rig that is probably <clears throat> in total. I mean, probably, uh, it, it doesn't say anywhere, but it's probably like nine feet tall. I mean, it's, or even less. Probably seven feet tall. <laughs> Let me see if it says it here. You know, too much information about the colors and all that, but the, the stuff that really matters, they don't uh, really say, do they? Oh, well, in, in any case, this one would be 21889 here at the show today. And, uh, yeah. Hi, Robert. Hi. <laughs> Not doing nice All right, always great to, to meet uh, viewers uh, on the road, and especially here at the RV shows. I, I get to meet so many of you guys that it's, uh, it's uh, really cool and really rewarding to, to hear your stories. And um, okay, let's look at one more. This one is the single bed, two, 400. The prices are, start going up as the roofs start going up, as, as you would expect. This one has a dinette here in the front and I like the fact that they have window in the front 
And um, pretty nice. Uh, so, so someone, someone left their lens cap here, and uh, very has, has quite quite a bit of uh, of um, I was I was saying a um, counter space. I don't know how well this will hold up in the long run, but it seems well made. Um, and here, this is a different style refrigerator. It's a very, it's an isotherm. It's a very tiny freezer here, by the way. And this is all electric. This is a um, compression style. And here we have a wet bath. It's very nice, actually, very, very, very beautiful. It's, it's quite spacious, if I may say so myself. So yeah, th this would work out for me. And here we have a drop-down sink. That's very nice. All right, let's continue. All right, one more. By the way, this have the Aldi uh, heating system, which is that, that combination of a water heater and, uh, and, um, and furnace. And uh, this one is 20, 2900 here at the show price. Uh, this is a tab okay. 192.32 model S. And uh, this one is very similar to the other one where we, that we stepped in that I barely uh, fit. And as you can see, I'm, I'm hitting my head with the ceiling here. So this is definitely an RV for shorter uh, uh, people. And um, the shower is the same. I'm here, I'm here bending my knees. Uh, in order to be able to in here, so to be in here, so um, oh, oh, and I having a hard time getting out of a shower with this bag. So unless you really need to be this small, you know, it's it, it there's an RV for everybody. I kind of like this thing. If I only knew how to operate it, there you go. Hopefully, I won't break this one. So, but it's it's kind of like glued to the to the glass. All right. Let's continue exploring. So that was uh, the new camp for you guys. There's a couple of mo other models, but actually, is that a truck camper they have back there? Let's check out the truck camper. I didn't notice the other day that they have a truck camper here. It's 31, 489 here at the, at the RV show. And this is a Cyrus by New Camp. And they had it kind of hidden back here. Is it open? Yes, it is. Nobody knows this is here. And uh, well, here we go. Not, not a whole lot of counter space, but uh, you have a sink to burner. Here's the hood. It's a nice bed area here, kind of um, a, a big step here too. To go up, you have a stereo, you have USBs on both sides, you have lights, you have storage down here, you have a small TV. Up here we have, by the way, this, this, is, this feels very light. And it's, uh, it's a different type of, you know, it's like, kind of like a soft closing. No. When you do it right, it's, it is soft closing. Huh, that's nice. And then you have a shower here. And uh, I don't see a toilet, but I see a shower, maybe. Hmm. Oh, I remember this one. Hold on, hold on. It's magic, it's the magic toilet. Yeah, we've got a... I, I, uh, if I could only find the light. But we have a cassette toilet hidden down here. So you, you would come in here, close the door, and uh, be stuck in here in the dark. That's the Aldi furnace, by the way. This is a cassette toilet. And, uh, and there has to be a light here. You know what? I don't think this... Um, let me, get, let me get out of here, I'm getting claustrophobia. I don't think this unit is connected to power, that's, the, that's what it is. So, um, you have the air conditioner there, which is 
probably one of the loud ones, but it's good. It's I actually it's it's it's, it's, it's Here we go. That's the the compre the absorption style refrigerator, which is cold, by the way. So uh, the propane must be working. All right, that was uh, the Cyrus by New Camp, and it's a relatively small truck camper, but it's kind of, I, I I I really like that that bathroom solution, where the the cassette toilet is hidden from view on, 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 until you uh, walk in. All right, let's continue exploring the Tampa, the Florida RV Super Show 2020. I'm riding, riding 